Hey everybody, I'm Brady and this is Tyson with Golf Ascending and we are going to do a review video on an awesome towel that's out there. Um, you may have ran into this problem. I know I have a buddy who, when he goes golfing, he brings two towels, a wet towel and a dry towel. It's not necessarily a problem, but you know, that's two things to bring. You might forget one. And they use a wet towel to clean off the club and the dry towel to dry it. Well, Frogger may have came up with a solution for that. So you only bring one towel that goes right on your set of clubs. And that's called the Amphibian Towel right here. Yeah, so as you guys can see, this is the Amphibian Towel by Frogger. Um, I've got it in the red, white, and blue Stars and Stripes America version. <laughs> But uh, yeah, I was actually pretty intrigued by this product. I was looking for a towel. Um, you know, I wanted something nicer. I um, wanted something that I could kind of throw around and beat up a little bit. Mm -hmm. um, so I, on my bag, um, if you, you guys will see, I've got a decorative towel. <laughs> One that makes my bag look pretty. And then I've got... Double bubble? I've got my Bettinardi double bubble <laughs> double towel. Double bubble towel. And then I've got this towel. This is the one that like I use, you know, for the main cleaning and like scrubbing and everything like that. Um, keeping the clubs clean. But um, just, you know, a little bit about this towel. So this is 14 inches by 14 inches. So it's a square. Um, on the inside here, we've got, it's made out of bamboo. So if you guys know bamboo, uh, they, it is waterproof. So uh, we've got bamboo in the middle and then we've got cotton on top. So we've got two different material. And so the theory that um, Amphibian has is that, or Frogger has for this Amphibian towel is that you can keep this outside towel dry and then wet the inside and you know use that to wipe the clubs off and then the dry them on the outside. Yeah. And so And it goes the other way around. Yeah. Right? Yeah, absolutely. So like if it's raining outside, um, we're already gonna have a wet towel on the outside, so we're gonna keep this inside one dry. Yeah. So ways. yeah, if you need to clean off your clubs, you know it's raining, wipe them off here, dry them off here, and then you're good to go. Boom, amphibian. So, yeah, so we're actually gonna we're gonna test this out. Um, live here on this uh, on this video but um <clears throat> i actually have never done this test yet surprisingly i've had this on my bag for weeks and weeks and weeks yeah um and it's a great towel um you know the reason why i haven't actually tried you know the wet dry part yet is we usually ride in a cart that has the club washing yep. machine on it so, so you just dry it yeah off. so generally i just you know scrub in the um, club washing machine take it like a taco and just wipe it just like that take it like and a taco. good so you know, for those purposes, you know, I, I, like I said, I've used it for weeks. Um, you know, I actually haven't washed this yet. Um, gross, right? <laughs> but um, you can see a little bit of, of wear here, but it looks pretty good for being on my, you know, my bag for this long and, and washing and drying off my clubs. Um, so yeah, been a great towel. Um, some of the things that I will point out. Um, so this is the way that you hook this towel on your bag. This is actually not my favorite thing about this. I'm, I'm starting with this negative. It's this little teeny carabiner hook, um, and then on this little nylon um, little thing that's sewed onto it. And so my big worry when I got this was, when is this thing gonna give? When is this thing gonna fall off? Which, when I looked on Amazon and looked at the reviews, those were most of the negative reviews and pictures that were on there is that that's kind of flimsy and it has fallen off for people. Like Tyson said though, it hasn't fallen off, it's been fine, and you said you're pretty rugged with it, you're not like being careful. Yeah, I'm not, so. I'm not babing it, you know, I'm not carrying it around like that. But you know, it does, it, it does scare me a little bit, and especially this, so on Amazon this is $30. Um, so $30, you know, for a towel, it's not the cheapest thing. But it's like two towels. But you know, yeah, it's like two towels. It's not the cheapest thing, it's not the most expensive thing, but you know, if this little, you know, piece of nylon were to rip, um, and it were to fall off, that would be pretty frustrating. Yeah. And um, so yeah, that's my only complaint about this. I only wish that Frogger would put like a little circular metal bracket here. Is that what it's called? Ringlet? Ringlet? I don't know. I don't know. You guys let us know in the comments down below, but to, <laughs> yeah. to stamp, you know, a little ring inside the towel. So, you know, the towel's not going anywhere unless the towel actually rips. Yeah. Um, and that ain't gonna happen if you've got a little mm. ring on there. And the carabiner would go perfect with that too. Absolutely. Yeah, so um, a couple other things I've learned though. So aside from the, the taco shell method of just wiping the club off, um, I actually also learned if you fold this up like this and you use this carabiner and you hook it on as well. Let's see if I can do it here. Oh, look at that, it was quick. So if you hook it on there like that and then you can hook this onto your bag. 
So you've got this little pocket here, this mini taco, <laughs> I like to call it. More tacos. More tacos. Taco Tuesday. Maybe we'll release this on Tuesday. Yeah. But uh, yeah, so like this, you've got this pocket in here still for your clubs, but then I also like it too for, you know, washing your ball or, you know, something smaller in this little pocket. Yeah. So that was just something I came up with. Um, you know, I may just, I don't know, I may be the only one thinking it. Probably don't um, want to try that on a rainy day, hence that it would take away from the <laughs> one side dry or not, but. Right. That's pretty cool. Yeah. So, I mean, overall, um, I think the functionality of this towel is really good. It's really durable. Um, you can feel that the quality is really good. Um, it's really thick. That was something that I, I noticed right away when I got it was it was really thick. Yeah, it is. Um, and I, I liked it. Um, it feels durable minus, you know, that one little thing up there. Should we do the test? Let's go for it. Okay. So we're going to douse probably this part in water and see how, you know, wet it is. But then we're going to see if this side is dry like it advertises. You ready for this? All right, Gatorade squirt bottle, right. here we go. I'm, I'm not holding back. Oh God. Hey, you know what? You can actually already tell that it, the water's kind of already like Whoa. floating on the surface there. I don't know if you can see that. Water! You can see that? It? It's lost. So we let's won't count that this. This there. is a little wet let's on here. Let's get that in there. So let's flip. Oh, did we get it wet there? No, on, it's fine. on the back there. Let's scrub this in here. Yes, because right here, it didn't touch any water. All right, so now let's, yeah, let's... let's flip this over now. Okay, so the wet's right here. Let's flip this over. So is this wet? Oh wow, it is dry. It is very dry. That is super dry. I, this is actually, I'm very, actually really surprised. It's the first time I tried this. You could put salt on that and then blow it right off. Yeah, that is dry. That would, that would, I could wet the club on this. Press down on it. I put a ton of water so on yeah, there too. Here, so I'll, I'll wet the club so you guys can see on there that you can see the water on it my wedge. It is wet. And then we can take this and wipe to get it dry and it is not as wet. Still dry. So that's pretty good. Um, I'm pressing too. Yeah, that's pretty cool. So I guess, you know, guys, um, you know, if I were to recommend this product to you, you know, I would say the towel is great. Um, I don't love this thing, um, but the towel overall is great. If Frogger decides down the road to put a little ring at the top um, and put the carabiner in there with a the hole, I think this product would be 10 times better. Yeah. Um, you know, and that's just a small fix that maybe down the road they can do. But, uh, you know, if, if you can find another way to attach this to your bag, if you want to go and, you know, punch a hole yourself in there, um, strap it to your bag, I think it would work and you wouldn't have to worry about it falling off your bag. Um, but overall, I think this is a great product. Um, for $30, you know, you get a dry and a wet towel. Look at that. Wet towel, dry towel. So pretty cool. Um, something to note, they do have other colors of this. I think they got like six or seven different colors. Oh, yeah. um, so, you know, pick a color that black, suits you. Black, blue, orange, black. Yeah, and uh, you know, use our, our Amazon link down below if you do decide to do it. Yeah. Um, you know, like I said, it's a pretty cool product. Yeah, if you enjoyed this content and this review, make sure to like the video and subscribe. We do create weekly golf content. We'd love for you to be a part of our community and uh, thanks for watching.